Action International is a British uh, firearms manufacturer of bolt action rifles. Uh, we're well known for uh, supplying militaries all over the world and uh, we have a new line of the ATX rifle which is uh, competition use and we've got uh, the full line of the ATX at rifles and chassis systems here at the British Shooting Show. So this is our chassis system that fits the Tika T3 rifle, uh, barreled action. We also have one for the T1X uh, uh, rimfire. We also have them for the Remington 700 platforms. Um, and again, rimfires and full bore. Uh, the difference is the length of the uh, forend. So for the rimfire, they're shorter. So this is the actual chassis system that you put the barreled action into. And it literally drops in and is torqued onto action screws. The features of the chassis system, we have the RRS Arca style rail along the fore end, which also has our patented key slot system. We have the optional bridge, long bridge, fitted on this chassis system. As you can see, the fore end um, is quite long with a barricade stop. Our key slot continues along the magazine section. Our magazines fit in there. We have our um, wide paddle style mag catch. You can fit various different uh, AR style grips. They come as a fixed stock, but we do have a, an accessory hinge system, so it becomes a folding stock. And the butt pad is adjustable, cheek piece is adjustable, and this Picatinny rail gives you the option to add uh, bag riders and other accessories. This is the Accuracy International ATX in 6.5 Creedmoor, um, designed specifically for the sort of competition shooting PRS style um, with our AI barrels made by Accuracy International. Um, they are heavier profile uh, with threaded for various uh, muzzle brakes. We have the optional long bridge on this one. Again the Arca rail, the iconic ATAX short action with our bolt um, pistol grip we have a competition trigger adjustable very nice for the competition shooting and the adjustable uh, back end has got the adjustable cheek piece and length of pull. Accuracy International has a quick lock barrel chain system so um, the screw here if you loosen that you can by hand unscrew the barrel and change it out for different calibers on, and different barrels. The reason we have the flats cut in there is if the barrel is hard to remove you can put a, a spanner on it and it gives you leverage. So this is our um, other line of rifles that we do, uh, the AX line. So we have, um, this is the latest AX Mark III in 328 Lapua. They are all multi-calibre, so they can be 328 Lapua, 300 Win Mag, 308, 6.5 Creedmoor with our quick lock barrel change system. Um, this is the AXMC, and this is also an AXMC. This one's in 338 Lapua, this one's in 6.5 Creedmoor. And here's the big 50 calibre. AX50, and over on this side we have uh, the AT and the ATX, as well as the AXMC, so our full line of rifles. Well, my name's Dave Walls, uh, I'm one of the founder directors of Accuracy International. We started up uh, in the late 70s, um, basically I started working in my shed, servicing rifles and making parts for them, tuning rifles. Uh, and it developed into a business where we made our own target rifle and from a target rifle it turned into a military rifle. Um, I met a guy named Malcolm Cooper, twice Olympic gold medalist and um, it basically went on from that. We, we uh, put a, a weapon in for the um, uh, L96 British Infantry Trial uh, along with 17 other manufacturers Basically, it only went in just to see how our product fared against others and to learn by our mistakes, if you like. But it turned out that uh, after a few weeks, about eight of the 17 had gone. And it was uh, quite, we were quite bucked up at the idea of that had happened. And then, then it, uh, it progressed on, another month went by and uh, we were down to five. Um, I began to get a bit worried then because I thought, if we win this, this is going to be very difficult because I've only got like the, the, the end of my garage, which I call my shed, which I work from, where I've only got uh, model-making machinery 
and it's been rather embarrassing if we win a contract for 1,200 rifles because there's no way I could do it. And uh, yeah, it just went on and on, and it got down about three, and I was beginning to lose sleep at night, so I thought they're going to throw me in prison if they think I've taken them for a, an idiot. Then we won it. Then I was worried, <laughs> uh, and it, you know, from there on, it was. Uh, um, sort of tell the truth, you know, come clean and say, well, we've only got a garden shed, and they decided they'd find a place for us to manufacture the rifle. Uh, but I had to go and oversee the manufacture of it and make sure it all went together properly. Uh, and then we won the Swedish contract, followed by the German uh, uh, G22 contract, and then Belgium came on the scene and wanted rifles, and it just turned into a, a massive international uh, event and it's grown to the size it has today and to be perfectly honest I'm absolutely amazed that it went from a garden shed to what we've got now. Um, my main, um, when I started my main thing was target shooting, it went to military um, rifles, then I began to worry about uh, make, making sure the troops had a weapon that would last in any any weather, any condition, because the last thing I wanted was somebody to actually have one of our weapons and it fail, uh, and maybe they might even get killed, and it would be because of a mistake I'd made. But as it happened, we just kept on going. Um, it turned out we were making better products than all of our competitors, um, and here we are today with a, uh, a tremendous name in the industry, uh, making first-class weapons. We make our own barrels now, and we're now re-looking at the target world because that was where my roots were in target shooting. We're re-looking at the target world because that's really where I'd like, like us to be, as well as military, of course. But um, as you can see by our products, um, I, think, I think they are the best in the world, and we are, I think we're the world leaders now by far. Store, which is a separate company from the Actricy International. I provide all the merchandising with anything you need. You've got several caps. We have range polo shirts for all the days on shooting, which Team AI wear themselves for their competitions. We also have several products, if we look this way. On our full product board for the British Shooting Show, I've got a new launch on with five new products. We have eight two designs which are available in long sleeve and short sleeves at the moment, cotton and polyester. We also have the new OD Green Rifles League, which also has the skull on the back, in a cotton t-shirt, which is unisex. Standard black t-shirts, also in unisex design, with the world sni sniper rifle on the back. The range polos, such as Helicontex, which Team AI wear, is available in black, OD Green, and Coyote. These are all blank on the back. We have Velcro patches on the side of the Helicontex, so, and we also sell patches themselves. We have two colours in skull designs and four different colours in round circles. There is also additional zips for notebooks, pens, anything with range information. And I also have ventilation zips underneath on the Helicontex. For the more colder ones, we have grey winter knits and OD green beanies, including neck warmers and gaiters. Traditional AI logo red and red and grey, or your more camouflage colours of OD green, charcoal and dark earth. We also have an assortment of Cerakoted key rings. No, Walls and Irwin, who are subcontracted with Accuracy International, who do the barrelling and Cerakoting, have communicated and corresponded with us, and we have created these dog tag key rings of the several colours, including blue and red, which links into Accuracy International civilian rifles in red and blue.